Roses are red, violets are plenty. Welcome to the chic assignment for 2020. I couldn't help myself. Welcome back to The Daily Connoisseur and welcome to the first chic assignment of the year for February 2020. We took a break last month from the chic assignment, but I am looking forward to getting into it with you this year. What is the chic assignment for those of you who are new? Well, I feel that in our world, we get consumed with um, news and mindless entertainment and a lot of dumbed down entertainment. So I believe that it's very important for us as ladies and gentlemen to cultivate our minds, expand our horizons, to learn about different things, and also just to improve our daily life. So that's the point of the chic assignment. So I assign four different things each month, and the fifth assignment is to always be reading, by the way. We want to keep reading, we want to read more than we watch television and the like. We want to keep our minds sharp. So let's jump right in for the very first chic assignment of the year. Okay. You've heard me talk about this piece many times in the past, but it has never been in the chic assignment. February is the month of romance, and so I am assigning Tommaso Albanoni's Adagio. Adagio is perhaps the most beautiful and romantic piece ever written in classical music. And I have a video of Hauser performing this piece, and it has over 45 million views which gives me hope for humanity, <laughs> it really does. You have got to check out this performance. It is one of the most magnetic and dynamic classical music performances I have ever seen. It is emotional, it is moving. There's a reason why this has 45 million views. You've got to see this video at least once this month and listen to this incredible piece. Also during the check-in, we're going to learn more about the composer's life and more about the piece itself. Chic assignment number two, we are going to study the works of Edgar Degas this month. He is a French impressionist painter, he was also a sculptor, and he's famous for his ballerinas. And so he does beautiful romantic paintings as well, and there's so much to dive in with him. I'm going to leave some resources down below, including a website where you could look at all of his works, the complete works. I'm also going to leave some book recommendations and other resources for you down below. So Edgar Degas is one of my favorites. I wanted to actually include him last year, but we never got around to it. But I think February is the perfect month to study his works because they are romantic, they are beautiful. There's so much behind these paintings. So when we do the check-in uh, halfway through the month, we will learn more about Edgar Degas and more about his incredible pieces. Chic assignment number three is to have intentional downtime. So I've been noticing something about myself lately that I'm not quite happy with. When I have a few moments to myself, I just surf the internet. I mean, why do I do this, right? And I'm sure many of you do this too. I waste my downtime by surfing the internet and just reading random headlines. <laughs> So I'm unhappy with this about myself, and when I have a few moments, I wanna be more intentional. So whether that is sitting down with a good book and continuing it, or simply being present and having a cup of tea, having a nice conversation with someone, we want to have intentional downtime. Of course, there's a place for surfing the web and just kind of vegging out a little bit, maybe watching TV, but we don't want to do that every chance we get. So let's just notice this month how we spend our downtime. And if you'd like to make changes, go ahead. If not, just simply notice what you do when you have a few minutes to yourself. Do you pull out your phone? I'm curious. And the final chic assignment is to do something romantic this month. Now this does not have to involve a significant other. It could just be a romantic gesture that brightens your day, like putting some flowers right by your bed, or taking a bath and reading a good book, or just doing something romantic like a long romantic stroll. Do something this month that adds some romance and beauty into your month. And of course we're going to continue reading our books. That is the chic assignment for February 2020. Please share this with your friends with the hashtag the chic assignment. Invite as many people as you can because this is such an enriching experience. I can't wait to see you for the check-in where we're going to learn more about Degas, Albanoni, and talk about the other assignments. Thanks for joining me today on The Daily Connoisseur and I will see you on Monday. Bye.